You can't, nah, I'm gonna read them off for you. Good. Yeah, y'all know what it is. It's already recorded, though. I don't know who went to bed yet, but y'all went to bed too early. Feel me? Y'all went too early. You know what I mean? Y'all see who I got in the building tonight. It's a terrific show. It's political. You know what I mean? It's hard. I wanted him to come on when he first came came out. I wanted him to come on, but I couldn't catch him. But through my fam, D, so, so well, deaf. Yo, you get a verse. I think I'm going to do this, so I got a purpose. You niggas worthless. Since you been born, you ain't do shit. I've been on the move it. You ain't been on the move, mix. I'm a young genius. Most of these niggas get stupid. I hate these niggas hating. But see, I'm just waiting. They calm down. I'm very patient. I'm ready to deliver. But I ain't talking no more. Let the weed man be the raw. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I've been waiting on that verse for probably like 15 Thanks years. Thanks you know what I mean? You know what I mean? That's fam, so that's fam. Give they fam, ball, you know what I mean? Man. Yeah, I got the weed man in the building, you know what I mean? Uh, yeah, yeah. What's up, Paul? You know Paul shouts you out, because you know Paul, what I mean? what's up, my guy? Yeah, you know what I mean? You know, yeah, exactly. Eminem, we got, yeah, original. He originated because he come from home with us. That's you know us. What I mean? Zach, what's good? Yeah, we got the New Jersey weed man in the building. Y'all got, y'all, y'all have any questions? Talk to him. It's around a certain time. That's why I'm kind, we kind of hitting it, and I want him to hit the mic. Talk to y'all. Well, ain't no mic, but talk to y'all live. Up here, you know what I mean? We got a superstar in the building. He got autographs before he before he came in the building. He got some autographs. We're gonna ring the bell for him. You know what I mean? Texas, Louisiana, uh Denver, Colorado, all them spots that have dispensaries and all that shit, you know what I mean? My man right here, he's been pushing for years. We've been seeing him throughout the state pushing. We got a real genuine hard knocker right here, you know what I mean? What's good? We got the weed man in the building. Yeah. Yeah, man, what's good? What's happening, man? What's man, what's going on? I don't know. You, should, you, should, you would think I'd be happy. Yeah, that's what I was you thinking. Think. Yeah, I would, would think, think around Everybody this time. Like, yeah, you know what I mean? Legalization is like that far away. Far away, yeah, you know what I mean? But guess what? Talk to him. It excludes damn near all of us. It, it take us out of it's, the... It's, 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 they're making it legal for rich white guys to sell weed. And yes. they want us to buy weed from them. From them, yeah. And... They still put us in jail for selling it. That's crazy. You That's know? crazy. I can't ring the bell Yo, for that. Yeah. It's, it's, it's super crazy. If, if you, the, the bill, the law that they're talking about passing right now, next week, two yes. weeks from now, yes. it's called SB 2703. You can read yes. it online. Yes. It's a felon ban. It's if, a... if you have a felony, yes. you can't be a part of no company that gets a license. You can't even work for them. You can't even work for them, can yeah. you? Nah. Damn. So listen. You, uh, look, you can't be a farmer or none of that? Well, again... Because that's the other side the, of no, it. The growing part, yeah. you need to have $2 million operating capital to apply for that. Wow. So, to grow weed, you have to be... Uh, a multi-millionaire. Most of us so we trying to trying to trying survive, to trying, to yeah, trying, trying to get up. Yeah, we trying to get up. And trying to get up, man. And they sold the, the, the they're trying to sell this culture, this industry, yeah, to the rich white guy. And yeah. we're, and, and people are supposed to what patronize them? Yeah, they nah, it's nah not at all, no. not at all. So I I've called for a boycott. I've yeah. been saying things like we shouldn't comply with it. Yes, you know, and 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 and. As a protest, you y'all local going to see this probably in the paper tomorrow. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Talk to I've them. done a couple interviews. I did NPR New York yesterday, yes. and they're going to run it Monday. But this week, as the politicians are talking about legalizing marijuana for the white guys, yeah, I've decided that I'm going to sell weed yeah. like I'm white. Like that? <laughs> I straight up. I, 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 I made a hashtag. Wow. Y'all check out the hashtag. Wow. It's hashtag sell we like I'm white. White, yeah. So this week, Thursday, the twenty first, yeah. I'm just gonna openly start selling weed. Word is mine. Like we're Word out of the spot, out of the out yeah, of the yeah. spot. Twenties and eighths. So what not I'm saying, the but spot, they come but what if not out the spot, not, not out the spot, not out the spot. Not out the spot. Oh oh y'all see me? He already know, hand Yeah, y'all already just get in contact. Yeah. I'm gonna be FaceTime live and FaceTime live in. Yeah. And look, look, y'all, people laugh. It's I wish real. I could rap. It's real. I'm not I could selling rap. nothing out the spot. Yo, stop fucking shitting on me. Yeah, yeah. Look, we talk to him. He know what he's doing. 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 I wish I could rap. 
Yeah. I, you know what I was spit? I yeah. spit something like, like Rosa Parks. Yes. She refused to get in the back of the bus. That's right. Yeah. They trying to keep us out of the can of bus. Yes. Like, Talk to like, them. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Talk to them. You know? Talk to them. And, and and selling weed like you white ain't no different than sitting at the diner like you white. That's, That's what right. they did. They had sit-ins in the '60s. They That's wouldn't right. let me eat. Wouldn't let me be a part of these fucking diners. Yes. Shit. So. They protested by doing it anyway. Yes, right? yes I'm yes. doing the same thing. Yes. They're making a law to make all these white people rich, make them millionaires. They're still gonna be locking you up. Yes. Listen, when 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 Thurston Howe the Third yes. forms Talk his home. cannabis company and he starts selling pounds and pounds of weed yes. and paying taxes in violation of federal law. Yes. The state will protect him. That's part of legalization mm -hmm. in New Jersey. Mm -hmm. But you, Pookie, Muhammad, Hassan, yeah. Yeah. whoever, you get caught with fucking a pound. Yeah, yeah, they yeah. They're going to try to get, still give us the same time they were still trying to give us a, a couple oh, years, years ago. ago. Yeah, they, yeah. They ain't making this legalization the way it's done is, is not any different. So look, is the, um, you know, if we get, if we sell a pound and we get locked up, are they, now they might are, even deny you bail. They will. So <laughs> it's going that deep. It may. So you know, that that means it should, to me already. it should change in the form of if it's going to change. Like all right, they're going to have they're going to be able to sell weed. It should the the uh the crime should change as well, right? Well, I mean I, I don't think so. You don't think it'll change? We're still the, the, here's the deal. Yeah. If you get if you get caught with a little possession. Yeah. No, the, the law is going to help you. Yeah. You're not going to get like, jammed up for having a bag of weed now for yeah. having a blunt. Yeah. Right. But what if you sell weed? Yeah. Wait. First of all, think about this. One hundred percent of all people in New Jersey right now buy their weed from some weed man somewhere. Where? That's right. Right. That's it's right. all illegal. It's That's all right. black market. It's That's state, right. Right. That's now right. me calling myself <laughs> the New Jersey weed, weed man. man. That's been on, put that. That's on some narcissistic ego yeah, thing that yeah. I've always had. I'm a little yeah. vain. <laughs> That's you right. You know what I mean? That's right. I'm vain. <laughs> I clean the entire state. That's yeah. right. But there's a weed man in every single community. I'm not even really from Trenton at all. Yeah, I, yeah. But I know. That, hey, if I stepped out your door, there's some weed man around. Around, right? yeah, it gotta it's, be. Yeah, it gotta every be. All community every community. Got a weed man. Yeah. You know, yep. some people used to take offense that I called myself the New Jersey weed, weed man. man. Yeah, yeah. But, but you ain't in my neighborhood. That's right. <laughs> But, yo, ah, but this was my PR. This, yeah. was, this was what made me, listen, I'm not a, I always told people, listen, man, I'm not a performer. Yes. I can't get up there like Jay-Z and yeah, 50,000 people in the, in the stadium. Yo, but it's almost I, like yeah. that. It's but, almost like that. But, listen, when I talk, the press follows me. Yes. If the newspaper writes about me, 100,000 people read it. Yeah, yeah, you know, mad people it follow the internet. It yeah. goes all across the country. People know me in Canada. Yeah, fans, all over. Australia, whatever. Because yes. I've been speaking publicly out. Yes, you know? yes. There's new, there's, there's, there's new age protesting too. Yes, right. That's right. My hashtag. I want y'all keep. I, I'm gonna keep saying it. Hashtag. Sell weed like I'm white. That's Somebody right. type it. Somebody up there type it. Type it in. Yeah. Sell type it in. Sell weed like I'm white. white then yeah. when you click on it, you're gonna see all the different things attached to it. Word up. Word and up. here's another one. Talk to him. Hashtag. Him. NJ can't get twelve. Wow. You know what I mean? What that means? What that means? That means I don't take no please. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, oh, I'm I'm going to Sep try. Separately from weed, yeah. I'm famous for fighting my own case. That's right. And take it to trial. That's right. And say get twelve. That's right. The last four times. Yes. They couldn't get twelve. <laughs> they couldn't get wow. Yo, wow. I got a better. Listen, I got I got a better record percentage wise than Robin Lord. Word up like that. <laughs> <laughs> that's Look, hard. I've that, had that's nine, hard. I've Jeez, had baby. five trials and I won four. Four, yeah, that's and right. I had a couple charges hey, that got dismissed. Yo, his man. To the boxing yo, fans out there, yo. I got Mayweather <laughs> numbers. <laughs> Right here, right here in, in Mercer County, oh. yes. they hit me in the last two years with 38 charges. 38? No, 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 sorry, my bad. 41 charges. How many stuck? Zero. <laughs> <laughs> How many did I win? How many you won? I'm 38 and 0. <laughs> There's three of them hanging. That's right. And that's just because I haven't I decided to throw that knockout blow motion oh, yeah. to dismiss. Yeah, wow, <laughs> wow. I'm going to use that on a slow 
media day. Word One up. day I'm going to file it. I'm going to win. Yeah. And then the newspaper will be like, damn, he won them other three too. <laughs> <laughs> Talk to him, fight, hit him you right know? from here. Yeah. This is the new fight right here. Yo, this is the new fight. Yeah. I got the weed man in the building. Hit him, weed man. Yeah. Talk yeah. your talk. No, I believe in jury nullification. That's right. Dude, I be telling people all the time. A lot of people don't understand jury nullification, but listen. You have a right in America to a fair trial. You have a right to face your witnesses. You have a right. You have a right to assistance of counsel. That's right. It never says nowhere in the Sixth Amendment that you have a right to a lawyer to represent you. Yes. It says you have yes. a right to assistance of counsel for his defense. Yes. So I always choose my defense. If the law's wrong, I'm representing myself. Yes. And I force the system to give me a lawyer to assist me. Yes. And then you know people are like the lawyers sometimes they go all mad. They want to fight about it. But yeah. I'd be like, nope. Yeah. Yeah, yep, nope. that's right. Stick I, to your I, guns. I understand, yeah. I understand my rights. And it pisses right. them off. And, then, and listen, you'd be surprised at how many times they try to shut me up and not let me tell other people. That's they, right. They, oh, they, yeah, they did. Yeah. do this. They come at you like yeah, that? Like yeah, try to corner you? Yeah, they, they tried a few times. They tried to. This last time in Mercer County, they actually tried to stop me from doing it. But then what can they say? That I've had five trials in New Jersey. Yeah, yeah. You know? Yeah. The other three times, I was allowed to represent myself. How's Mercer County going to stop me from representing myself? Yeah. They couldn't stop me from representing so, myself. So do you think this is, uh, you think Mercer County the hardest county? No, to be honest. Who, who the hardest county to really no. know? Burlington County gave me a lot better fight than Mercer County did. To be honest with you, <laughs> they I've did. been laughing at Mercer County. Man. I gave a two-piece pack pack. Word up. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, two you make it. There's two prosecutors in Mercer County got black eyes. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, you they lost to the weed, man. <laughs> yeah. so, so listen, yo, listen. I was talking to a public defender recently, right? Yeah. And she said that as a joke, when, when one of the prosecutors says something smart to her, she says she gonna stick the weed man on her. Word of all. <laughs> <laughs> we man whipping ass in that courtroom, man. <laughs> yeah. Listen, yo, and I had the and I had the weed charge. That I was like, come on, uh -huh. bring it on. Word. They dismissed the case. <laughs> Now I'm rubbing it in, y'all. Y'all gonna watch, watch They the gonna see this. Y'all gonna see y this in the talk to This is America, y'all. Yeah, and, yeah. And, and I'm a... I'm a black man who's angry. Talk Why am I angry? Him. They fucked my life up over weed. That's right. I was going this way in my life. Yeah. And I got arrested. Yeah. My life went that way. It ain't never going to go back that way. Well, that's so right. That's what always motivated me to be pissed off and talk a little shit. That's right. And most of the time I do it nicely so white people like me. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They do, yeah. You know they what be mean? on you. So, yeah. they, uh, so they do be on you, though, don't they? Them right, uh, right. rich folks. No, I like I got a lot of support. They talk about yeah, you know, it's a lot. You want to? Uh, y'all want to? I read it. I'm too just, far. I'm away. about. I'm about to. Let me run through. Let me run through. Yeah, I'm gonna just shout. Tracy, uh, yeah, we go, shout to Tracy side yeah, effects yeah, yeah. on it. What's up, Tracy? All right, let's just shout man? him out. Born Wise says, uh, you know, says, uh, weed man. They on you, Zachary X says, yeah, the weed man. Uh, Boston Havoc was good. Sheen Rock was good. Zigzag was good. Oh, Paul was good. Ski Vasquez was good. Jamar, uh. Thread Gill says, uh, what's up? This this is a mechanic from Fire from Firestone. He knows you. Oh yeah, yeah. Stay yeah, low, Rondo, up, what's happening? Tracy Sidefect says, uh, Weed Man, uh Weed Man is that guy. Weed Man is that guy when it comes to uh standing tall uh against the criminal justice system. Much respect to him. Yeah, yes, you yeah, know yeah. what I mean? Yo, you Shout know, hey, Tracy, hey, Tracy, you know how I feel, Dude, man? man? I feel that I'm the David. Versus Goliath of government. That's the big. The government, yeah. the government is the Goliath, man. That's big. And I, you know, I just lose my little slingshot, Pat. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> yo, yo, dude. Rob was good. Cam was good. Dan, uh, Lighty says, "What up, weed man?" They mainly shouting you out. They ain't really asking too many questions. I am. I have good. a guy. I have a um homeboy who said, uh, with the uh, rich guys getting in the uh getting into position to buy these uh. Uh, dispensaries he said is it is it gonna change this is somebody who he asked me personally is it gonna change the uh strain on the weed like what well are they gonna make it weak which well, how I they think, gonna how they gonna I do think it as legalization comes that's gonna open the markets and there's gonna be better strains that will be coming here from other states there's yeah be more ship more in bulk if the cops here kind of lay off the weed there's gonna be there's gonna be better strains around yeah yeah yeah, right. yeah. as these I call them the, the CCCs, these Caucasian Cannabis Corporations. As they get successful, as the years go, and 
they, 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 they start having these huge warehouses all around. Yeah, the yeah, yeah, growing. yeah, growing. There's going to be more strains here than okay. here. Okay, okay. I mean, to be honest with you, the best weed in the world comes from California. California they yeah. ship the most weed. Yeah. That's... Shipping now. That, that's what's that's what we're getting now. Now, that's yeah, that Cali is coming from Cali, yeah, right? I don't even want nothing from Colorado, by the way. You don't? Know, why not? Why why not Col why not Colorado? The best weed in the world comes from from, from Cali. From Cali, it, it is. The is. weather's <laughs> the best there. The strain's been the best there. They've been growing there for a long time. You know? Yes. Some of them, some of them strains in the hills of, of, of the, the best farm. Yeah, stuff, yeah. They, they've been, they've been around since the sixties. Sixties, yeah, these, you're right. These dudes have been growing indoor down yeah. in Southern California. All yeah. the OG strains. Yeah. And, and all the cushions and stuff come yeah. out, of, out of Southern Cali. Yeah. Like they, they don't really compete. In Colorado, they Even can't though, touch them. They can't they're touch Colorado. They're getting the same strains and they're growing them now, so they're 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 getting there. But they don't have the the production levels that California got. Yeah, they yeah, yeah, yeah. Outside, yeah, they could grow outside in yeah, Cali. You can't grow like that in Colorado. Yeah. You have to have a warehouse. Right? House, yeah. You know, and they're growing on mountains in in in, in, in Cali. Um, uh, X, what's good? X Ski Vasquez says, "How do you uh feel about jobs? Up, uh, jobs." Job uh, protection. Piss testing uh, yeah, yeah. and legalization. Uh, do, do you know they just changed up. that again last week? They, they tried to add job protection to it. Yeah. And they announced that they did it. And within a couple hours, the business association and, and, the, and the lobbying yeah. people, I call them the bribers. Yeah. The bribers who've given money to the politicians from the business association. I forget exactly. Tracy might know what I'm talking about. Yeah. They scream bloody murder. And within a few hours... They took that language out. So there's no, even in this new legalization bill, there's no job protection. Meaning like, yeah. it, you know, your job can still fire you for smoking weed. You know? whether, so whether they got whether, you or not. Whether it's illegal or, or not. not. Wow. Yeah. That's crazy. You know? How so, about, no, nah, but what I was saying was the, the strains, are they going to, uh, you know, like, because they got certain medication. My man got a medical card, right? He showed me today. He said, yeah, they got some, some, some burn it bull. Touch you if you got a head, a constant headache. If you got an ankle ache, they give you this for it. Know what I mean? Like, yeah. what do you well, think? They're gonna be lighter. It's gonna be expanding. No, it's, gonna it's, ex it's gonna be expanding as far as how many strains are around. The more and more. Like, if you go to California, you can go to some places and there's fucking eighty fucking. Yeah, in yeah, there. yeah. You know? Dif uh, that can, different one, right? Yeah, you can go somewhere and they got. Not only do they have all these 80 strains of weed, they have they have all kinds of waxes and hashes and yeah. edibles. Like some places are like supermarkets. Marks, yeah, with Angeles. that, yeah, yeah that's yeah, right. Like supermarkets of weed. So obviously, at some point, when when we get to that acceptance level here in New Jersey, yeah. we're gonna have things. We're gonna have it's that. gonna roll. Yeah. It's gonna roll. Yeah, but it's not. It's not gonna. It, it, even if they legalize it tomorrow, people. Yeah. You're talking a year or two before it actually gets put in place and actually starts. Yeah. And we're not going to have no parts of that, too. I keep on trying to say that. So we Very eliminated. Sure. We just the customers. Just, All we are is customers. Just imagine this. Mm-hmm. For the last 50 years, I'm just going to go back to 1970 or so, right? Yeah. Before on drugs started. Yeah. And we've been the victims of it for... You know, we get arrested at three, four times the the, the rates yeah. that our that our white counterparts got. Mm -hmm. We catch all these uh, these felonies. I mean, my, the first two, I went to prison twice, both times for weed. Weed, both yeah, times, for like, weed. So I'm saying, small or, yeah. or big? I got a ten year sentence the first time. I did eighteen months of it for something light. Nah, for I something light. With, I got caught with forty pounds. But, okay, okay, you know, damn, yeah, that's I, something. I, I, you know. <laughs> 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 Yo, see, yo, you know what the funny part about this? <laughs> funny part about people in Trenton, right? Yeah. They met weed man the activists. Yeah, yeah, right? yeah, That's yeah, yeah. Met. This met what, weed yeah, yeah, talk to him, right? talk to him. Right. But the weed man from Camden talk to in him. the 90s yeah. was more on the, I ain't gonna that say Nino yeah, Brown. Tip. I'm not yeah, gonna say Nino Brown, but I was bringing hundreds of pounds back and, and forth across the country. I was buying houses and cars and Jaguars yeah, and, yeah. And, and stuff like that. Yeah. And I attracted the attention of the DEA and the DEA, the, you know. Came down. Yeah, yeah but came you down. know, I got lucky to be honest with you. They passed the case off to the Camden County Narcotics Task Force Word instead up. of uh, Instead of, you know, I ain't go through the Fed system on that charge. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, but uh, when I was in Los Angeles, it was the DEA that ran it down and put me out of business. Out Word up. Yeah, and work. I tried to open up secretly a couple months later. <laughs> they showed up with cameras talking about, you trying to start a new investigation? Wow. It was time to leave. I went back to, I came back to Jersey. Jersey yeah, ran up out of there. How long you was out there? How long you was out I LA? I there for five years. Five I, years. I used to pop in and out, too, yeah. before that, you know, go on the missions and. 
thing go yeah. hang out. You know? Yeah, so yeah. I had a good time in L.A. Yeah. But now the DA basically told me to get out of L.A. Get out of there. I'm, Word up, I'm they kicked you out. Yeah. yeah, they said get out of here. Yeah. You just left. Yeah, you yeah. dope. You yeah. dope. Yeah. You dope. dope. I got to give you I came back home. I sat chill for a little year, a year and a half. And I was like, man, I was sitting down at Sicklerville. Came to Kansas. Word up, yeah. And I decided I want to I wanted to do something in Jersey. And yeah. next thing I know, I was coming up bar hopping in, Can in, in Trenton. Yeah. That was 2014. I was bar hopping up here at night, yeah. hitting ends. But you was up around. here before that. Why not you up here before? Used to cover me, yeah, they used to cover you they, in, in, the early, in the here. early thousands. I yeah. thought you lived up here. Nah, I ain't live here. They you didn't. Just, they just the Trentonian and the Times of Trenton used to just cover me. Yeah. You know, but other places, I mean, to be honest, when you look around. The Los Angeles Times cover, cover you, I yeah. Mean, I should look around, Chicago yeah. Chicago Tribune, cover, you know, yeah, yeah. They own you. Papers in North Jersey cover. I've been, I've been covered for a lot, which, which is amazing, because, because. To be honest with you, really, I'm kind of broke. Yeah, right? yeah. But I, I come, but I come with a million dollar PR. Yeah. Right? I can't, I'm, I'm Let me ring that. Yeah. Let me ring. I, I be telling people all the time, man. Imagine if I could rap. Yeah, <laughs> right, right, right. Yeah, he would. If I came out with a rap shows, song, yeah. it would be nationwide. Nice, nice shows, shows, shows like, yo, continuous shows, man. man. <laughs> this guy be all over the place. <laughs> yo, they said, um, said, ask him when, uh, when do he think uh, weed will be legalized in New Jersey? Uh, on a recre recreational I, level, I think federal. it's going to happen within a month. Within a month, like that soon. Jersey, yep, it's coming. It's coming it's hard coming. too. They, I think, they within push the next month they're going to vote on it. Maybe two weeks from now they're going to vote on it. Will it make it or not? I don't know. The feds now, yeah, it's still still one hundred percent illegal. It. But yeah. they have there, there's really no federal prosecutions for weed. Yeah, it's not, is it? But if they lift the ban, yeah. you could do other things. Yes. There's other things you can get involved. Maybe you can transport weed across the country, you know. That's the only like that. thing. State right. line, um right. state line yeah. And, and 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 Cory Booker yes. is actually standing up on that one. So you would run with him if he could. Right now I would yeah. pick Cory Booker. I would go I would run with Cory Booker. Out of all the Democratic candidates, I would run with Cory Booker right now. Oh, yeah? Just based on his weed oh, meter. Yeah, oh, his, my oh weed shit. Meter. Now, there's other things out there. Yeah. That, 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 eh, you know, who knows? I'm not 100% down with him. His yeah. antics. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The drama all that. stuff yeah, yeah, that all he that. get into. Like, come on, man. I'm having <laughs> Strong brother, like, he's strong brother. Yeah, you met him. You met him before, yeah, right? I met him before. Yeah, but I, I, I like him. Yeah, I like him. I like him. I like him. I'm not not. Yeah, don't be not again. Not <laughs> Let me listen, Kamala Harris. Talk to him. We're gonna talk politics for a second. Talk Kamala to him. Harris. I like her. Yes. She sounds like the good feel good story. Daughter of an immigrant, Jamaican. Talk to him. This, that, and the other. Did well in college. I think Howard. Yes. Went to L.A. I mean, went to uh, San Francisco. Francisco and yeah. became the head prosecutor. Yes. And that's where she loses me. That's what, uh, San Francisco? <laughs> because, because she puts a lot of brothers in prison. prison yeah, she, wow. She, she was a tough yeah. prosecutor. Yeah. In order to excel, she was tough. She had to be, yeah. She put a lot of people in prison. She, she took on cases... That that, that 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 had racial overturns. Yeah. So she did it. So yeah. it wasn't a racial overturn. overturn. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know yeah. So they used her to yeah. flip flop. The, uh, you know. So she's gonna have her issues as as the as the as the presidential campaign yeah. go, uh, moves forward. Yeah. There are gonna be people going to attack her on the fact that she was a prosecutor. Cuter. She put so many brothers in prison. That's right. That's you know, right. She, so, she enforced the drug war. Yeah. And we know that's a racist drug war. Oh, yeah. So she enforced it. So they, these are they're gonna be conscious people are gonna be aware of that. Yeah. So she's not really I don't think she's gonna be at the, the, the top of the key at the end of the day. She's not gonna win on, on that bit. tip. Nah. Book, book Booker might get shot down over rumors too. Oh, yeah, yeah. I, you know, rumors of what? Rumors. Oh, okay, okay. Because yeah, yeah, right. I have not, then, well, I've heard a couple of things, but yeah, not really. He's engaged. Well, he's and, dating. Uh huh. Yeah. I'm a girl that played in Men in Black too. Oh, I'm a sudden, crazy girl, and she's an advocate too. She so is? it's like it's like a perfectly made thing. It's kind of yeah. like a Barack and Michelle. Story. Oh, okay. You know what okay. I mean? But you know, it's some more into that. It's yeah, some more. People gonna talk. Yeah. Then it's Bernie. Bernie. He's just old. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like he's just oh, yeah. For an eighty-year-old dude to be president, that's right. He's not a lot of new age things going on. No, on, that's right. And Talk I know to he him. He seemed to have attracted a lot of young kids last time. Yes. Um. Who knows? Maybe him and that dude Beto can hook Beto. up on Beto, 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 Beto yeah, whatever, whatever. Can yeah. hook up on on some uh on on a, on, a, on a whole ticket. Yeah. Um. 
We don't want to hear nothing from Hillary. Nah. <laughs> she coming. Yeah. She coming. Yeah. She's still ain't she still, Yeah, she ain't 68 yet. You know what I mean? She shoot. She yeah. gonna shoot. Yeah, this like, this I'm still, the first you know, woman. You know what I mean? Uh, yeah. um, there's, there's a couple Spanish dudes. Uh, you think um, they got a chance because you know I, I, the um, population of Sp uh, Spanish is real heavy, yeah, they, and they yeah. really back their candidates. Like they, boom, they right. cap back their right. people. And a lot you of them are conservative, I saw. So yeah, a lot of them. A lot of them. Yep. They're conservative, even though they are brown. You know yes, what I mean? yes, yes, yep. They are brown. That's right. right. So I don't understand. I mean, I've been racially profiled by Hispanic officers. Oh officers. yeah, on the regular. Yeah, on the regular. Yeah. yeah. And, and you know, I mean, some of them understand some. A lot don't get it. Right? Yeah, right. yeah, yep. yeah. They just doing that's, the that's job. That's a hurdle. That's a hurdle as far as division. Yeah. For us. But yes. whatever happens. Yes. It's going to be a woman on the Democratic side, people. It is. You think so? They lined up. Oh, they man. Set it's it. too they lined many up. candidates. Where, where yeah, it's it, too many again. They're, they're, they're not. But see, that's, that's, that's just the primaries. Yeah. They're going to whittle them all. Yeah, yeah. They're going. Yeah, that's the prime. Yeah. Basically, two years but before the election. Time, yeah, though. yeah. So, it's time they get people building momentum they, for the they real are. guy. Yeah, who's the real guy? They are. They're gonna they be fighting Trump. They are. They fighting Trump. They yeah, they, fighting that's Trump. what the um whole big battle. Because this dude will slip that. around, slip, slip yeah. up, and he'll be in there again. Like yeah. he can. So right. he right. He right. He right. Y'all don't think Russia cheated? No, yeah. no Russia mess with oh, the That's yeah. what they say. No, they, they did. They That's did, what they right? say. He, no only, he, he only won by 70,000 votes. And there was a time I was I was bitching it. Black people in Michigan, black yeah. people in Wisconsin didn't yeah. vote, and that's yeah. why we yeah. got Trump. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I was bitching it. Man, all these, all these yuppie white people yeah. was voting for Jill Stein and, and, and writing in Bernie. Yeah. And that's why he got those extra 70. Word, word, word. Yeah, yeah I believe it was the Russians. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Because we see different. <laughs> I want yep. to this. I want to. I, I want to see an indictment of Trump's kids, right? Yeah. You know, yeah. I want to see Eric Trump explain why he's got a meeting. He's with meeting Russians. with Russians yes. who are and and then Paul Manafort's giving them polling data. What do you think they're going to do with it? Yeah, that's right. They put in all kinds of. Uh, 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 Facebook ads and yeah. and, 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 and created and, and fake created accounts, created accounts, accounts yeah, yeah. yeah. It's, it's racial caused tension. all kinds of racial tension. That's the first it's, time it's been done though. So it's, whenever it's the first time you gotta expect that type, you know? Do you remember well, we two years it. ago? Yeah. All of a sudden, everybody was mad at Hillary for calling for calling the black people uh, 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 predators. 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 Uh, yeah, uh, what's the name? Super predators. predators right? Yeah, yeah, Yo, that's right. Now we, we realize <laughs> yeah. the Russians was putting it out there. Yeah, like, you know, like that. Yeah, forgot that. They was putting up all kinds of ads. You had black people all over the country talking about, oh, fuck Hillary. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. Word, up, word up, word up, word up. Yeah. Yeah. And, 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 and come yep. to and come to fight. Like it was something. They was she they were screening. She said a couple of things. Yeah, a lot of white people are secretly racist. Mild races, mm, yeah. you have extreme races, you have low, low yeah. races where you gotta basically punch them in the mouth for them to say nigger. Talk yeah. to them. You know what I mean? And yeah. then there's just institutional races that they don't even yes. realize that it's just it's like, yeah, 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 exactly. Just, if you ask them, they would be like, no. And I and I run into a lot of people like that. And I listen, I run into people who are totally not racist. That's like, right. Facts. Totally not Facts. racist. A yes. lot of them are not. They're not. not they're talk like, to they're them. Not. Right? Yes. And, but at the same time, there's a lot of them that also don't want you talking about it. That's it right. Yeah. Football. Yeah, right? yeah. Talk they, about they it. They be like, I'm not a racist. And no, everybody's not. We're all green or whatever they say to me. They're That's all, right. They're all cool. And I'd be like, yeah, I know. But I'm not talking about you. Yes. But I need to talk about them, too. Yes, yes. And those, those are the ones that cause people like me problems. They don't That's cause right. people like me problems. You yeah, yeah. Say, somebody else's yeah, problem. Like, yeah, yeah. yeah. I never heard him say nigger to yeah. me. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck you supposed to say to you? Yeah. <laughs> Say that yeah, to you. To you. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah. right. We all got I that white friend that's been in the room when your supervisors was going in, or your coworkers were going in on another race, whether it's black mm -hmm. or whatever. That's right. And or made a comment and hit them like, yeah, you know what I mean? Yeah. Those freaking yeah. Kind of guys. <laughs> it's like, yeah. And, and that one coworker come back and be like, yo, don't trust uh, Joe. That's right. Don't trust yeah. uh, such Tom such. in yeah, the office. Yeah, yeah. Don't trust Mary Lynn or so Mary Beth. It's right. more of a mental, no, you saying it's more of a yeah, mental They play this game with mental, you, man. Um, like, out, which hand is in? And they know mm -hmm. whatever, you know what I mean? They don't have it in hand, and it's not for you. So they be like, yo, I don't have it in no hand, but you like, it's in that hand. Like some sucker <laughs> stuff. And right, they, right. Yeah, they no, playing I, mind I, games. I, mind I get games. along. 
I get along with, with, with everybody, to be honest with you. Yeah, me too. I, 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 don't, I don't really care. Yeah. You know, especially in person. But you can if address I'm it. Talking about yeah, you can address it if you see it. Yeah, you know I mean? can, yeah, I can, yeah, exactly. That's how I am. I, I can get along. And, and to be honest with you, I don't care what race you are. Yes. I'm usually cool until you rub me wrong. Yeah, and it, yeah, wrong, yeah. Let me ring that. Right. Yeah, do that. Yeah, I'm kind of done. Do that. You know? That's what I'm talking about. I, I just don't like people in general. He <laughs> not yeah. Yo, I ain't gonna lie, right? They Ed and Ed's girlfriend, she's Italian. Yeah. And she called me racist. She called you a racist. She called me a racist because you know why? Why? I didn't know the ins and outs of my people. Yeah. yeah. You talking shit you know about black saying? people? Yeah. Like, he go, know, he go in. <laughs> listen, I know when we had. He go in. You know what I mean? What kind of event we gonna have? I know what kind of trouble we had. That's right. I, I'm walking around. Could you not smoke cigarettes in here? Yeah. Please, sir. Not in the temple. Can you not smoke cigarettes? That's now right. I'm just taking cigarettes out of niggas' hands. Hands, yeah. Nah. Then they looking up like, man, what you doing? Yeah. Man, we done told you stupid ass. Stop smoking. Yeah, you are right. You are right. So like, you I mean, enforce we, we it. How come we don't deal with this when uh we have the rock band over? Here? That's right. You yeah. know what I'm saying? And that's yeah. the type of shit. I'm not racist. I just need people to act better. Yeah, be better. You're right. At least, yeah. That's right. Better, you know what I mean? I ain't better than nobody. And that's like let me ring that. I do it, y'all. I ain't bring my glasses, so I can't read up. I uh, can't read Mike, up now. Yeah, Mike Ingram said, um, what part of awareness or political shit Mike that Ingram. keeps you somewhat grounded? Man. Alright, how I Poverty. answer that one. <laughs> yeah. The re- <laughs> yeah, the re- yeah, I was gonna say the reality in my friends. pockets. <laughs> I know, I know when I'm talking to a politician, he just throw it. If I write him something, he just throw it away. There ain't no check in there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you, know, uh, you know, when it all comes down to it, I don't care if they like me, joke me, or whatever. That's right. And I ain't put a, a, a paycheck in the a check. Yeah. In the in the political account. Yeah. You know. I'm you know it ain't coming back in your face. Right. Nobody got time to waste. It's like yeah. that the world revolves around that money, man. But I do. The worst I do get ever, people man. to. I do get people to. The, the, the politicians kind of do pay attention to me. On yeah, that, they man. do. That's, they that's do. The funny part they about do. it. If I'm down there around the state house. Yeah. They coming. White man. dudes in suits come talk to me, and half the time I don't know who they are. But a lot of a lot of people just a lot you of know? people take a liking to you. Like yeah. I don't care what color they are, but a lot of people take a liking to you. A lot of people enjoy your story. A lot of people like they just listen to you. They'll follow you in the whole yeah. nine. You yeah, know you're I mean? right about the prison system, my man, Justin. Yeah, keeping the keeping the uh, keeping racism around. Yeah, there's more than just the the prison system. Even like when we talk about marijuana legalization now. Yeah, yeah. They, yo, they're taking people that already got them records, the felonies, and they're just transferring it into this. I'd I be mean, like, they're swapping out races. Mm-hmm. Prohibition for racist legalization. They're using yeah. the same numbers and advantages they got in. And prohibition to, to, to switch it Yeah, and yeah, you know? just like the lottery yeah. and therefore the and same way. Yeah, they're treating everybody, you know, like certain neighborhoods. Listen, I got to tell you something. I didn't grow up in Trenton, yeah. but here's what I remember thinking about. Cities like Trenton, Newark, Camden, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That, that, that certain, I'll say forces, mm-hmm. use those areas as... As the catching fields yeah. for the new age concrete plantation system. Yeah. And that's that's what's going on that's too. That's right. That's deep. That's right. That's right. That's that's right. right. That, that, that is. That's, that's, that's what's going on. That's, that's what that's it is. It's and it's like, like a generational thing because it's ongoing yeah. until now, right? Yeah. That's even, mm-hmm. even now with them making this legal that you think okay, ain't nobody going to weed no going to jail for weed no more. Yeah. Yeah, right. <laughs> Mad people still All you want have to do is have more than fifty grams of weed again, and then you're now you're distributing, and you're still going to prison because prison. only the Fully rich white weed. guys, now, yeah, yeah, are, some, going, yeah. are selling weed. weed. They're wow. the only ones allowed to sell weed. Now you- Man. If you have a joint or two, yeah, all right, legalization is cool for you. Yes. If that's yes. all you ever want to do is smoke your, smoke a joint Small or two piece, and mind yeah. your business, you, you could. You're going to like this. That's right. Right? That's right. But yeah. somebody wants to hustle a little weed. Yeah. Yo, how, what about the people who buy a quarter pound of weed? Yeah. Four ounces for y'all. Yeah. You don't understand. I mean, yeah. Right? Talk to them. And, and, and you sell three of them with a little tax on it mm-hmm. so that you get yours for free. That's right. Technically, it's still distribution. That's right. You know, and everybody in the weed culture knows you're just trying to smoke for free. 
Yeah. You know, get your people. Something like, yeah. yeah. Get your people to pay for it. Yeah. Right? But that, and that's very prevalent. But you know what? You know how many people got felony records because of that? They got caught with that quarter bill before they got rid yeah. of it. Me? Yeah. Me? Yeah. Me? Yeah. That's what happened. Yeah, mad people. Yeah. yeah. So they gave me a $65,000 bail Damn. for QP. For something Dude, light, yeah, that's yeah, light, man. Yeah, really, yeah, that's yeah, really yeah, light. But, but that's that happens to a lot of people. Felony. Yeah, but I got caught with a QP. So. Two years, what? Two years ago? That's like, not like, like longer than that. Couple longer years? Than that. Yeah, yeah, like probably like five years. That's really. I've been staying out of trouble, man. Like, for a minute, yeah, you yeah, you have. You ain't been me. you ain't been in the way. And that was how you and that was just petty shit. You know how they play it. You know how township play. My first big weed bus was forty pounds. It was, it was, it was, it was forty pounds of a two hundred pound lube. <laughs> how many? Listen, how many have you gotten off? Oh, I've got. Can we off. talk about that, yeah, or you don't want to go time? into that? Talk to him. Yeah, yeah, What's the biggest amount? Yeah, it, ain't, it's, yeah. it is. It's a limitation Yo. on it, is it? Oh hell yeah! Oh okay. Listen, listen let me let me yeah. let me tell you. I I I I got. I got lucky. Yeah. When I I accidentally became a big weed dealer by accident. Yeah. Word <laughs> up like that. That's kind of how it happened. Look, I was a truck driver. Yeah. In I remember that. Or so. Yeah. I was in I was in Phoenix. I had about three thousand dollars of truck money in my pocket. Uh huh. Maybe four thousand. Mm -hmm. Right in my truck. Mm -hmm. And I was visiting one of my cousins who grew up in Woolenboro, but his mom and them moved to Phoenix, and he moved with him. Oh, so yeah. I hadn't seen him in years. So bam, I got out. Stop by Phoenix, when you're going across town. Me yeah, going across state. Our, yeah, me and him smoked our first joint together when we was fourteen or fifteen in Jersey. So of course I'm out there with him, like you know, that's just so yeah, weird. doing us. Right? Yeah, you doing us. Like, yo, yeah. it was like. I said something about, like, let's go some weed or something. I think I said I had some money. I think I tried to hand him, like, 100 or 200 dollars. He was like, man, you can get a pound for three. Wow. I was like, what? 91, we right? Phoenix. Hey, I was in Phoenix. <laughs> I was like, what? Yeah, yeah. I was like, what, for real? That's yeah. That I got the pound. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and then I'm looking at it like, oh, shit. Yeah, I just got this for 300 pounds. Word. Yeah, 300 dollars. I was like, man, I can get this off for 1,000 at home. Yeah. Um, you got ten of these? <laughs> like that? Wow! Yeah, wow. I had, like three, I had a little bit more than three thousand dollars on it. Yeah, yeah. So Bam. you got like ten and dude joints. Dude made a deal. He's like, he sold me ten pounds a week for three three thousand dollars. When you Ooh. came back, how much you knocked the pound off for? I came back and got thirty. Damn! <laughs> yeah. And then a, a thousand months later, a stack of yeah. piece. Yeah. A couple months later, I got a hundred. Damn! And then that's what I kept doing every so often. Often I was you doing a hundred, <laughs> and, and and that's how people in Camden knew me. Like man, that dude disappears. He yeah, back come back. He got, got 40, thousands. 50, he got all kinds of pounds. Damn. And then, then the greatest thing ever happened to me. Talk to him. These Mexicans I was dealing with, they was already calling me Jersey by this time. They yeah. knew I was from Jersey, Jersey but yeah. they tried to front me a couple bricks or something. Yeah. I didn't know what it was. Was it garbage? Take it. Some no, dirt no, weed. Some her no, some heroin or something. Oh, some some shit. cocaine, big ass blocks. No, they yeah. Yeah. Something, to something in the low. Yeah. Try to give it to me to get it. Yeah, they do open it. Yeah. Like yo, you can get rid of this in you Jersey too, them, right? Yeah. I was like, nah, man, nah, I can't do that. And I was like, I, I turned it down. Yeah. So then that's when they started calling me Jersey weed, weed man. man. Like, wow. Know, does weed. Yeah. yeah. From Jersey dude, you know, yeah. does weed. You know, so I was no cool. cocaine, my man. <laughs> but, but they like, they like me. Yeah. And then here's what happened: this white dude from Cleveland, yeah, went out there with two hundred thousand dollars or something, yeah, and bought all the weed. Damn. From the dudes that I know, so no, I was yeah. out there to get a little bit of weed, thirty yeah, get pounds or something. They was like, "Man, you got weed here, man. We gotta get some more." This white dude came and bought all the weed. And I was like, "Okay." So I was just hanging around for a couple of days, just having a good time, listening to like, "Yo, you want to make a lot of money?" I said, "Hell yeah!" Hell yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He's like, you know that dude pull up all the weed? He's like, yeah. He said his driver quit. So oh, we ain't shit. giving him his money back. Oh <laughs> He's shit! He's stuck in Arizona with all this weed. And he's yeah. like, yo, you you wanna drive? We'll hook you up. Yeah. And I, I hooked up with him and, and they was like, he was like, you can rip him off. You Whatever you want. They said that, yeah, you they got said. Money, you put it on your truck and you can go left if you want. Wow. That's what they told me. Yeah. But yeah, I talked yeah. to the dude, I was like, I didn't want to do him do like him that. Right? Yeah, yeah, right? yeah. He yeah. told me he'd give me twenty five percent of the load. Wow, okay. So I was like, hmm, twenty five percent of the load, I gotta get it to Ohio though. Yeah. And I drove it to Ohio. Yeah. 
I ain't get scared until I was right in the suburbs of Cleveland. I oh my thinking, gosh, yeah. Wait a minute, am I getting ready to ride up into somebody else's investigation? Yeah, yeah, because it's, like, it's like they that. know it's on the way, but yeah, they yeah. don't know where it's coming from. All of a sudden, I show up and start unloading my truck, and I get arrested, so I remember I was Hold scared up. of that. Or when I get there, they go, fuck that 25%. How about take this 25 cap in the head, pat? Yeah, you yeah, all like, that. So yeah, it go dirty, yeah. Things, so that's when I got nervous, right? Yeah, yeah. But then, everything worked out fine. Dude shook my hand. He was so happy that I saved him the rest of it. He thought the Mexicans was going to rip him rip off. Him off yeah. They was they going usually to. do, yeah. They, they was going mm -hmm. to. It was in the air. Yeah. It was. Yeah. It was, yeah. The it was air. contemplating it when they like, oh, Yo, you want to make a couple dollars? Yeah, like, yeah. And yeah. they told me I could do it. Do it, yeah. They go, you know, yeah, they, they yeah. Going, they really didn't like that guy. They wasn't going to fault me for it. If he let them put this on my truck and I decide to go to Jersey, yeah, he they wasn't going to fault me for it. Yeah, they didn't mind what. They, they, which way they, it had, went. they had their money already. Wow. They was trying to help him a little bit to save a little face. I but anyway, way. long yeah. story short, <laughs> yeah. when I drove out of Cleveland, I had like 115 pounds of weed. It was all mine. Yeah, I yeah. called my brother to tell him that I'm on my way, told him what happened. Yeah. And I still had the money that we had all put in together to go do something. I so sell. what you do with the but bread? Had, what you do had, with the bread? Man, I bought a house. <laughs> Oh, listen, listen, some of yeah. my family members, listen, you know what the crazy thing is? Yeah. I, I mixed the weed in with a real legitimate load of cantaloupes. Yeah, yeah. So my family for years used to joke about cantaloupes. Yeah. You know, I'd be like, yo, when you get another load of cantaloupes, you know what I mean? Like, it was a family joke. Cause it was like, yo. this dude brought a cantaloupe. He brought home a, a, a truck full of cantaloupes. Yo. I, cause I went to my mom's house to unload it. So I yeah. parked my truck in front of my mom's house. Do a couple cantaloupes out. My mom was like, oh, what do you bring home? I was like, cantaloupes. And then when she put the cantaloupes in the house, my brother was putting other kinds of boxes in the truck, in his truck, and drove away. Yo. And then all of a sudden, bam, buying houses and cars and shit. Where it started up <laughs> yeah, from there. That, yeah, he that said. Was, that, was the big, that was my big come up. That yeah. Was like, that was, Yo, I got to give you a bell. Give me a bell. Yeah, I bought a bell for that. That's yeah. my man. Yeah, yeah he said, good. "Shit, the bread I bought a house." Yeah, he jumped it off. <laughs> yep. I bought that's one. It didn't yep. start to two. Listen, three. I didn't even just buy a house. I bought the house. Yeah. I had it sided before I moved. Oh, all that shit. I had a roof put on. On it. it. <laughs> I had a pool put in. Just, like yep. all of a sudden, I had two hundred something thousand dollars. Damn, yeah, straight like, cash. Just, yeah, straight it took cash. Took three days to make it. Yeah, I just yeah. Grew from Phoenix to Cleveland. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Dude gave me 115 pounds of weed. <laughs> In the 90s. This was 91. Yeah, yeah, that was about 92. 93. 93 there. And I shared it with, I had a couple of my boys. We all like did things. Yeah, and yeah. They Having helped fun. get rid of it. Yeah, and yeah. I took my family to like did Disneyland. Yeah, all like, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah all money. that. You so live it, yeah. A couple hundred thousand dollars for free. Word, word. You know, That's official, like, man. That's a well, dope actually, story. Actually, wasn't for free. Was taking a chance on yeah. going to prison somewhere along yeah, the way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember one time I got stopped in Arkansas. I thought I was going oh, to prison. Oh, man. What'd they say? I wrote it in my book. The Way Station? I wrote a book. You were you wrote, I wrote a book? book? I wrote three books. So I, you have them out? They out already? Yeah, I, I got a book called Public Enemy Number 420. Wow. When you read Public Enemy Number 420, there's a chapter called Buster. Yeah. I was at a truck st at a truck DOT center too one time. I was busted. Like I just knew I was getting ready to go to prison in Arkansas. Yeah, the way they was station. getting ready to search my truck. They had a dog, mm. and my dog got out of his truck and ran across the street and got hit by a truck. Oh my goodness! And the yeah. cops were so upset. They helped me put my dog up in the truck that I had weed in. Yeah. And 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 and, and they stopped their investigation. They felt bad for me oh, and let yeah. me go. Damn. Right. And they never, yeah. they never wow. looked in the truck. He told wow. me that shit. I was like, yeah. no. I wrote it. I wrote it in my book. He wrote it in there. In my first book. Public where the book? Where the book for sale at? Tell them where the books. On Amazon. They right on there. It's still on Amazon. It's still there. I, put, I published that book in 2010, but it's still on Amazon. Go to Amazon. Yeah. Public Enemy Number 420. Yes. There's a chat called Buster. Well, actually, yes. it's a whole section about smuggling weed. Yes. And, wow. And there's, but there's one chapter I dedicated mm. to my dog, Buster, who died to keep me from going, going to, prison to prison Yeah. In Arkansas. Wow. Think about that, y'all. Yeah, wow. Just, when my dog got hit, I started crying. Damn. And they thought I was crying because my dog was dead. And yeah. it was. It was I yeah. also thought I was going, I was to, going prison to prison in Arkansas. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> no, like, yeah. Arkansas, listen, think about it. Getting locked up in Arkansas. Nobody's visiting. Nobody's, yeah. like, nobody's liking me. I can see the judge giving me a whole bunch of time because I'm all, Yeah, judge. automatic. Because that's know? how it was at yeah. that time and probably now. Yeah. What's the worst state to move through state lines with? I'm still scared of the uh, South. The city, yeah, all of the South is. Ohio, Ohio, Ohio is hard. When you just said yeah. Ohio, I'm like, Ohio is hard, man. I don't know how. You know what I mean? You gotta drive the speed limit in Ohio. No, that's it, right? You yeah. go a little bit over, they on yeah. you. But mm -hmm. I, I, I've driven back and forth across the country. I, I I haven't transported weed across the country in years, though. But yeah. there was a time in the 90s, that was my thing. Yeah, you could I'd do that. I'd, yeah. shoot, I'd shoot to Arizona in a minute. Every time I got $10,000, every time I got $20,000, I'd go to Arizona. Yeah, it worked. You know, and, and get me a $300, $400 pound of weed, pounds of weed, bring it back here, sold every one of them in Canada for $800. Yeah. 1200 to the suburb. Yeah, yeah. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I, I did pretty well wow. in the 90s. And then, like I said, then, yeah. then, then the DEA came, jumped on me. I went to prison in 2000. No federal bid, though. No. They, they, yeah, the well, state, they, they turned it over state. to the, the, the uh, 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 drug, and, uh, what they call DEA, it, county yeah. high intensity drug drug task force. Yeah. The Camden County one. And they kind of like threw it out, kind of, if you. No, they, well, they just. The feds just pushed it off to them. I got okay. I got prosecuted in Camden County. So you did a light bid right. for that. Yeah, I did, did ten. I got ten. I got, oh, you I did ten? Flat, I got a flat ten, ten. Flat ten, yeah. I did. I did eighteen first. Eighteen yeah. months. I was out for five months, and then I got violated on parole for five months. Then I did ISP for a couple months, and then yeah. I was done. Okay. Then I got back yep. in the truck in. I transported a couple more times, and mm -hmm. I parked my truck one day and moved to California and opened a dispensary. That's dope. <laughs> That's dope. All right, we want my um. I know we got a couple more minutes. That y'all supposed to I probably been see. out of here. Yeah, we should been out here. Yeah, you know what <laughs> I mean. <laughs> uh, what is the point of being that uh being that cannabis uh cannabis yeah. god? Uh, what's the next move for empower um for the empowerment? Well, that's what I'm trying to tell people. In fact, check out the Trentonian story tomorrow. I think they'll get it right. Yeah, I'm trying to show people that like, look, I haven't capitulated. The legalization didn't come down far enough it ain't gonna touch the hood yeah you know and i th i think that the fight for legalization really ain't over yet i i'm hoping to somehow make some type of difference over the next next few weeks yeah. to, to to add at least a, a commentary a public conversation yeah about the situation that, that we're in yeah yeah just imagine Talk this for the last 40 years you know, the black market has provided 100% of the marijuana to the state's potheads, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You don't get, nobody in the state who smokes weed gets it legally from anybody. There's a yes. few, less than 40,000 people recently mm -hmm. from medical marijuana. That's but right. But the rest, everybody, you get it illegally. Illegally, yeah, from, that's from right. somebody, some weed man, that's right? That's right. Now they're making it legal, for say. And they're gonna make these other people, these cannabaggers, I call coming them, in. This they, is gonna get wealthy. They're the only ones allowed to sell weed, and the rest of us are still gonna be illegal, and we're gonna be going to prison and jail. It's like, imagine, like, you know. But the people ain't speaking out for your weed, man. That's yeah. that's one. So what understand. you need? What would you need to have? Like you just said, Follow people my ain't backing. That's it. Follow my hashtags. You need, see my fight. You need hashtag, you need money and backing, right? Yes. Hashtag. Sell weed like I'm white and hashtag NJ can't get 12. Those mm -hmm. are the two hashtags I want y'all to follow. That's dope. Hashtag sell weed like I'm white. Write it down. Yeah. Somebody type My it. My brother put it up here already. It. He put it okay. up there. Yeah. All right. And hashtag NJ can't get 12. Okay. And you follow those arguments. I can't really see y'all. Yeah, he don't got his on. glasses on. I can't mean? see it. So <laughs> and some of y'all, y'all, some of y'all <laughs> talking, and we'll probably read it after yeah. when the show go off. And we about to bounce, but I have one more question for him. What you smoking on now at this point in your life? What kind? What's the what's the flavor? Well, I ain't gonna tell about that fancy fancy package that came across the country last week. <laughs> you gonna go that far? <laughs> I'm a weed snob. I'm a weed snob. I, this listen, show's over. Listen, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm a I'm a weed snob. Yeah, right no, now, I'm smoking some good hash. Yeah. It came from uh, 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 the Laytonville area of, of California. So so the yeah. areas, it, it pertain yeah. on the areas what's yeah, good, yeah, too? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. A lot of listen, people don't listen, be knowing that's that. Right, that's right outside. Of the Emerald Triangle. The Emerald Triangle includes a couple counties out there. Humboldt, Humboldt uh -huh. being the, been most well known. Uh, 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 Mendocino. Yeah. And um, oh man, I forgot oh, the, the one where uh, uh, 
Red Bluff is that? I can't remember the name of the county. But anyway, if y'all follow, y'all know what I'm talking about. You know what I mean? But, yeah, yeah I give them your me Facebook. A, give them your face package. Just got me a good package. Give them your Facebook and where to stay in contact and watch for new you know, news. I keep telling people what you need to do. Do that. Is come through the joint sometime and get a turkey burger and a fat bud. <laughs> 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 get a turkey burger. Right. Come get a turkey burger, y'all. Yeah, no yeah. Come, Come get, get a turkey burger. burger. Come steak, get a turkey burger. That's right. And talk to me in a chef. Nah, I mean, on, uh, what's the show called on uh, Food Network? Our chef was on the Food Network. Yes, and he yes. won chop. He won chop. He fired. They Luke say the food is pretty good. Give him the address. Wings, man. Give him the address because a lot of people do go down there. 320 East State Street, we back open, man. Stop asking if we open or not. We're back open. We got events Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Directly Live across bands, the street from City, City Hall. Hall. That's right. right. Across City Hall. April 12th, we got Voice of Myra. She's got Freestyle Fridays coming in there. That's going to be super lit. Make sure y'all come through, check that out. 420, of course. Of course, 420. That's we're right. We're going have a crazy munchy menu. Yo, uh, just go a on, chill go vibe. On our, go on our Facebook. Go on our Facebook. Good weather. At NJ Weed Man. Man's joint. That's you know right. At NJ Weedman on Instagram. Yeah. Who is Dio on Instagram? That's right. Yeah. So, so. I ain't, sure what? About, I ain't sure about that 420, y'all. Don't pencil that in. Don't, yeah, don't, don't, it, pen, that, don't pen that in. Don't we pen. fought for that. What's happening, Daryl? I see you up there. <laughs> yeah, we right. Fought for that 420. What do you say? <laughs> So Skittles, eh. Skittles like the one we had. Eh. had it's some good Kush. I, I, I'm not gonna go and say it's some Skittles or some cookies. You know it's mean? a very good Kush, though. It's very yeah. good. It's very Is that good. our guy? Very good. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, right, I mean, I like to thank, thank. Smoke it up. What's up, boy? Y'all give him What's a up? thumbs up, up, hearts and all that. You know what I mean? Check him out. Back him up. You know what I mean? He's been, he been battling for years Shout with this. I've seen that. For having us and it's all love. You feel me? You know I mean? The whole city is dope. Ultimate and platform. And, 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 and what I want y'all all to remember. Talk to him. I'm 38 and old. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Mercer County going Haiti. Yeah, yeah. All right, we out. Peace, y'all. Thank you.